census counts people in homes big and small. You count if you're tiny. You count if you're tall. Because everyone counts in the U.S. of A. Everyone counts in their own special way. The census counts everywhere, count all who live with you. Sisters, uncles, grandmas, and your newborn babies too. Cause everyone counts in the U.S. of A. Everyone counts in their own special way. Hello, my name is Mayor Sean Wright of Antioch. And I'm here today to talk a little bit about the census. This is our opportunity to get counted. The census enables us to be able to figure out how many people live in our community. And those numbers are crucial. We use those numbers to determine how much representative we have in Washington, D.C. We use those numbers to determine how much money actually comes here to help those in need in our community. We need you to help us make sure that we get as many counted as possible so that we can count and get all the money that we need to help those in our community. Please help us help you. We count all your neighbors and we count all your friends until we count you. The county won't end because everyone counts in the U.S. of A. Everyone counts in their own special way. Hi, I'm Velma Wilson. I'm with 32nd District PTA. I am the VP of Legislation and Education. It is so important. PTA stands strong that we want to be counted. Why does it matter? Because all our students, all our schools, and all our families matter. So make sure you're counted. Make sure you complete the U.S. Census 2020. Counting is easy, counting is fun. Everyone counts, and you count as one. Cause everyone counts in the U.S. of A. Everyone counts in their own special way. Good morning, my name is Joy Motts, and I'm Mayor Pro Tem for the City of Antioch, and I'm also your District 1 representative. Antioch is one of the oldest cities in California, and our future, and our Rivertown District, and our historical district is so important to all of us, I know. But in order to protect that area, and also to protect the monies that come for our students, and for infrastructure, and for needs for our community, it is important for you to participate in the census. It takes a few short minutes, and when you do that, you protect us, you protect our future, and you protect the future of our children. So please, everybody, take this time, go online, fill out your sentence, and let's get this done. One, two, three, four. Everyone counts in the U.S. of A. Everyone counts in their own special way. Hi, my name is Lori Ogerchak, and I'm your Antioch City Councilwoman. Welcome to the city of Antioch, and I want to welcome you here today. We're going to do a caravan for the census. Have you done your census yet? If not, we need you to. They're so important. It's important to our community. It helps fund for our hospitals, fire departments, schools. This is how we as a community come together with the numbers so that we can have funding for different sources. I can't tell you how important this is. It's so important to be counted. Call your family members. Go next door and check with your neighbors and ask them politely. Did you fill out your census? It takes a total of three minutes. They've made it so easy. You can do it on your phone. You can do it on your laptop. You can even call in and do it. It's so important. Please complete the census today. Thank you. One, two, three, four. Everyone counts in the U.S. of A. Everyone counts in their own special way. Hi, Supervisor Diane Burgess, Contra Costa County Board of Supervisors, District 3. We are on one of our caravans today for census awareness. Got some great news. Contra Costa County has exceeded their previous self-response rates. We're doing really good. But the bad news is there's some communities that haven't gotten up to those levels. And because of COVID and because of all these different things, we're going to have a smaller window of time to get those numbers up. So we're going to be out going around making sure people are aware of it. It's really easy. You go online, you get it filled out, and then you are doing your part. Or somebody may come to your door, and it's okay. Answer those questions because everybody counts. During this time of COVID, everybody's kind of having to do things a little differently, and that's okay. But it's really important because when we, as we recover, those numbers are going to matter to how much money we get for recovery, how much businesses come in and do their part, and also it's affect redistricting. So all of your elected leaders that are up for election right now, those those boundaries will be changed to reflect the populations within those districts. So please participate in the census, register to vote, 
And just please know, be kind, wear your mask, wash your hands, physically distance, and be safe. And we'll get through this together. The census counts everywhere, count all who live with you. Sisters, uncles, grandmas, and your newborn babies too. Cause everyone counts in the U.S. of A. Everyone counts in their own special way. Hello everybody. My name is Jelani Killings, mayor of the city of Pittsburgh. Just want to take this opportunity to encourage everybody to fill out the 2020 census. I can't express how important this is to our community to ensure that we get our fair funding and the allocation of resources. This deals with what we receive for our schools, for our local roads and transportation, for healthcare needs, and also ensures that we get fair representation in government. I want to encourage everybody to get out there, let your family, your friends, your neighbors, let everybody know that they need to fill out the census. Everything that we know is dependent upon the census. And so we want to make sure that we get an accurate representation of our community at this point. The deadline is fast approaching, so make sure we want all of our business community, all of our community-based organizations, all of our community partners, our faith-based community, to spread the message and let everybody know that we all need to be counted. Everybody is important. Everybody needs to be counted. And the census makes sure that we get our fair share of resources here in the city of Pittsburgh. Join me and the rest of the community in spreading the message to be counted in the 2020 census. One, two, three, four. Everyone counts in the U.S. of A. Everyone counts in their own special way. Good afternoon. My name is Victoria Adams, and I'm president of the East County branch of the NAACP, the National Association for the Advancement of Colored People. And I'm here to speak to you about the census and the power that you have when you complete your census. The power that you have starts with the stroke of a pen, the stroke on your computer keyboard, the stroke when you use your telephone and you complete your census information. And when you do that, you tell Congress and your administration that you are looking to make sure that you have funding for your schools, you have funding for your hospitals, and you have funding for your community where you need it. So I say to you, your power begins with you and you completing your census. So take the time to tell your representatives that you deserve equal treatment and equity and complete that sentence. Because again, it all begins with the stroke of a pen. Complete the census. And I also want to encourage you to vote and exercise your power and use it wisely. Thank you. Woo! Woo!